All right, I'm gonna try to level up my account so I can get into prime matchmaking for this. That's it? Ah, screw it. Greetings, I, the War Owl, greets you, and welcome back to Solo Queue to Global Elite. This time, we have an extra challenge in our way, and that is the inclusion of Prime matchmaking, of which my account is not. Thus, because we are not Prime, we shall name our account Megatron. I'll let you work that one out. You have to be at least rank 21 to play in Prime matchmaking. I told myself, fine, you know what? I'll play the rest of these solo queue matches until I get to Prime, and then I'll get into it on this account. One of the reasons they came up with Prime matchmaking was to have an environment free of Smurfs. Like mine. So I guess it works. However, as a result, this account has been banished to the scum of scum, the toxic of toxics. If you thought matchmaking was bad before, this is what happens when you take all the good people and give them their own little playpen and leave all the naughty kids to themselves. Oh, they're here, they're here. They're creeping around B. Coming, buddy. Is he bomb? No, I went no. to party, man. Let 23 party. I got you, yellow. Yeah, they're close. No, I'm gonna die, dude. <laughs> got him. No, you're good. Fire the That's a good spot. So we got wrecked by an enemy raid boss. A raid boss is a player who buys armor on the pistol round and then has another player drop him a high impact weapon like the Tech 9. You can't just look at it and say, oh, raid boss OP. You have to look at it and say, wow, that guy landed some six shots, bro. Holy crap, this is what Battlefield 1 is gonna be like. I feel like I'm back in now. Rotate. Nice work. Nice. One place that I like to play water on overpass is to walk back onto the slope and then shoot over the top of the railing. Most players are going to try to push up close and try to take angles or jump on top of the box right behind it or try to sneak up behind them or something. I like this spot because you really don't expect a player to be peeking from there. The negative is that it is pretty exposed. It's difficult to get cover. If they see you there and react to it, you're pretty much dead. Probably monster yeah. problem. Planting A. Planting. No, it's B. Oh, yeah, there. No, it's B. There you go. I Where's couldn't hear, kit? um, is one of your mic- Orange, practice? your mic. Yeah, Orange, your mic is too hot or something. It's making a lot of noise. It was hard to hear, yeah. Yeah, when you when your mic's down, we can't hear anything. Yeah, it's fine, just just don't leave it down. Yeah, it's just a fan, dude. It's like 40 degrees, so... I am going to go, middle. Go, go. The spawn, the spawn. Someone go be 40 degrees, now we do- we know 100% you're Canadian. Nice work, Beauty. dude. This was the player on the other team that was giving us a bunch of trouble. Notice how he planted for bathrooms, but then played bank. Just a little bit of game sense could probably turn this guy into a great player. They're on the scene. Connected. Coming to you, Blue. Got that one, guy. Connect her. I'm out, I'm out. Yep. You kidding me? Well, sorry, it hurt, dude. I got him for 60. Or I got him for 30, sorry. Nice. Uh, again, this guy with the clutch. What was he doing, man? He was destroying us. Just another example of this player landing his shots but making stupid I'm decisions. Go. I'm gonna get one at Fountain. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go out. Go, go, go. Yeah, 
uh, since I got the spawn, I'll peek it. I'm going right out, so I'll stop at the corner. <laughs> oh, I lost my gun! Help! I lost my gun! The pushing connector going up. Peek in five. Oh my god, one's birthday. Third. That may have been my fault. Sure, we're 20. While we were behind in the points, something about this game felt actually pretty even. Like, it actually matched us up and gave us a really good game. One was... Oh! Good shooting, dude. Oh, what a fluke. Thank you. Alright, we actually have a chance with this. Well, with your hacks on, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our boy Mr. Man was having a really tough game. He started out with nay a frag. But once we switched halves, Mr. Man found his way and started wrecking things. Counter Strike really is a mental game. If you see somebody who's not performing well, they may actually be a pretty good player. They may just be having a bad game. Up close. Why are they all here? I'm done. I don't care. Hey, we got it, Mr. Man! What? Why would they all be there? Because their guys pushed no, at A. Pu yeah, they pushed A. And so along. they knew. They were. They had. They knew 100% yeah. that we were there. It's fine. It's fine. Exactly. One's fountain. Help me with him. Thanks, girls. There we go. Grab the bomb. All right, we're gonna get the bomb on our way there. I'm just gonna go for it. Activating the bomb. Okay. Oh my gosh! That oh. Another flick. Yeah, the dude does, like, he does not know English, I'm pretty sure. Smoke the planet. We're playing for that. Behind us, behind you, behind, 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 behind. Talk anyone. Guys, push in. For go, sake. go, go, go. I'll never understand the reasoning for not pushing with the team. We had B. These guys just chilled. They got the bomb dropped way back there. Just a stupid play. And that's the kind of thing that makes me really mad when playing this game. I was waiting because I knew he'd push the smoke. But he only did it when I went to throw a grenade. Standing on bomb, looking down the pipe. Nice. Hey, good job. One, One left. left. He was last seen water. He was last seen in the. Yeah. He's water. Yeah, nice. Mr. Man. <laughs> guys, you got when we were doing that B push, you guys had to push it in with it. We like had the site, but we didn't have the bomb. This game was actually pretty even. It looked like we were gonna come back into it. My teammates may not have been good players, but they actually communicated, and that's really all you can hope for in these things. I take full responsibility for any loss in this series. It just means that I didn't play well enough, I didn't land my shots, I did not carry hard enough, I did not win those clutch plays. Wow! Short these cold red. Play the bomb. You're gonna have to spray him through there. What the hell? Oh my god. 
Why would you use use what the f with that? Why did you- Overpass has become my weakest map. It's something I need to put a lot more time into learning and getting used to. Um, I'm thinking about going through watching some professional games, getting an idea of the different angles and positions people should be playing. But at least with Solo Queue to Global, we have such a wide map pool that we get to experience a variety of different maps that normally I would uncheck. Ah, damn it. We're getting into the meat and potatoes of non-prime matchmaking. I queued up against a boosting service in this one, which means two of their players were cheating and the rest were getting boosted. So as not to give them any free advertising, I'm going to block out their names. Here are a few of their greatest hits. This is the moment I realized in-game that these guys were cheating. Notice how he strafes out and pre-shoots me when I'm behind the wall. He made a stupid mistake because he's probably a child and it gave him away. So I checked while I was editing this video, it's been a few weeks and none of them have been banned. Cheating is the number one problem with Counter-Strike, it really always has been, and it sucks all of the fun out of it. 